since I figured it's going to be another 20 or so minutes before this video is converted and stuff, I figured I'd do another one. But first, I came across this. I mean, I know I bought it at the flea market some months ago, but um, I just put it away, not giving it a second thought. I mean, it's a, one of those 3D etched glass things, and I think it looks really cool. I paid 10 bucks for it at the flea, flea, at my favorite flea market. I can't talk this morning. Even though it's a souvenir from Hawaii, I didn't even think that there were any wolves in Hawaii. But enough of that for another time. Anyway, back to the plot at hand. All right. Since you notice I have the Satellite C855D laptop out, as you notice I'm already starting to deface it, because it's mine and I'm going to do it that way. And this camera's focusing in and out, but that's not another story. Point is, this little touchy pad here is just that. It's too touchy. As you probably remember, some of my videos were kind of access to page. I didn't want to access a page, and it's all whatever. So while I was at the good one on the south side of town on Friday, after county clerk's office, I found a mouse. Yeah. And here's the box that it came in. Yeah. Jumbo USB mouse. Honestly, it was a Christmas, Christmas gag gift or something. Brought to you by the same people who make the jumbo remotes, jumbo calculators, jumbo-sized snack cakes, I don't know. And this was distributed by Target Corp of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Sadly, made in China. Whatever. Paid four bucks for it. A little much, but hmm. Since I'm already using my other mouse, the Logitech one, because my wireless one decided to take a dump on me, only to find out that it wasn't that the mouse took a dump on me, it was my computer that took a dump on me. I mean, it's still working and stuff, but it just would not access the wireless mouse. And I'm rambling again. The point is, <clears throat> here is in person. I mean, look at it. It's bigger than my hand. I mean, and I figured just for size comparisonal differences, yeah. Let me get the top of you. It's like, holy freaking shit. So, yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to put this away, aside, and um, we're going to see what this can do. So, here we go. Is it wrong that my laptop's a Toshiba and my camera's a Samsung? <laughs> I don't know. Just thought I'd throw that in there. That's me. I think my lamp is flickering. Whatever. So yeah, where's the little pointy thingy? There it is. There's the pointy thingy. And it... <laughs> okay, let it finish uh, loading and shit. Alright. Come on, short life. Uh-huh. I don't have much in the way of files on this yet, but whatever. Let's check the weather. Alright, currently 71 degrees, and today it's going to be about 90. Tuesday, 91. Wednesday, 92. Thursday, they're calling for rain. And Friday, they're calling for rain. Either way, I think that uh, Lakewood HV12WR is going to be working overtime. <laughs> So yeah, I think this mouse will be perfect. I mean, it's a little bit clunky and big and whatever, but... I think it'll work out just fine. 
Although it will be more of the unpopularness at the Starbucks or whatever. It's like, eh, that mess is like so big. It's like, <laughs> yeah, whatever. Let me check to see how well it does for the web pages and stuff. <sighs> this camera is really pissing me off and I can't really afford a new one yet. Well, the pointer thing is a little bit speed, but speedy, so... Seems to scroll down pretty good, so... So, yeah. I think this will work out just fine. I'll have to get used to it. And probably when I get some more space, because it's really cramped in here, but... Whatever. <laughs> and I may have to recharge this thing soon. So I guess I'm going to conclude this video with the Jumbo USB mouse gag gift thing that I bought at the Goodwill. It will definitely work until I can get a smaller one or whatever. But at least I won't have to worry about losing it. <laughs> so I guess until next time, I'm Eski. Thanks for watching. Comment box is open.